I'm Dave Custer. Um, where are you from? Oh, where am I from? I was born in Boston. You're a native here. Okay. How long have you been at MIT? Oh, that's a long time. Let's call it 30 years. 30 years. So Maybe did you go here for undergraduate? I was an undergraduate here. Okay. And so I slept through my ESG interview and came back second semester. Okay. Uh, what do you do here? I am the fellow that teaches the writing courses at ESG, and I also work for the Writing and Humanistic Studies program, where I'm embedded mostly in mechanical engineering subjects. How long have you been at ESG? Uh, since the spring of 1979. 79. So you were an ESG freshman yourself? I was an ESG freshman myself. Okay. Um, so why are you at ESG? Oh, I never left, I guess. You never left? Uh, why do you teach here? I like it here. There's some amazing latitude in what you can do as a teacher at ESG because you have a lot of play to experiment and do different things. Okay. Um, and what do you think is the difference between ESG and mainstream? I don't know that there is a difference, but one of the obvious ones is obviously uh, class size, interaction with other people. And I don't think you'll find out what that difference is just by asking me, but I think you ought to go point the camera. I've only like 10 people, by the way. <laughs> okay. Is there any difference between ESG 30 years ago and ESG now? Oh, there's lots of differences. It's a lot more formal now and a lot more closely linked to the regular curriculum subjects. So how was ESG 30 years ago? Um, let's say a little bit before my time, showed up and you got 56 units for doing whatever you did and some people did work and some people didn't do work okay and uh it's just a it was really hard for people to have the motivation to get the work done they needed to get done and so it's become more formal okay right. thanks